This video will demonstrate how to launch and use VA Connect from other IES products, specifically Visual Analysis, Visual Foundation, and Concrete Vending. Let's get started. While VA Connect can be run as a standalone application, it can also be launched from within other IES programs. Launching from these programs allows the loads and available connection information to be exported from the model to VA Connect. We will start out in Visual Analysis where we have a steel structure that has already been designed to carry dead load, live load, and wind load. Moment frames resist the wind load in the Z direction and cross frames resist the wind load in the X direction. The columns of the moment frame are set to resist strong axis moment at the base while the rest of the columns in the project are assumed to be pinned at the base. Switching to the design view, we see that there are six design groups, including groups for the beams in the X direction, the beams in the Z direction, the columns, the beams associated with the moment frames, the columns associated with the moment frames, and the cross frames. Design groups allowed a single structural shape to be used based on the loading conditions for all the members in the group. For this model, the member design is complete as each group has a design shape that produces a maximum unity that is less than one. With the model built and the members designed, we are ready to design the connections. In the design filter, we can change the settings to show the steel connections. Zooming in, we see the base plate and shear tab connections for the members. The dashed shading indicates that a connection is ungrouped. To create connection groups, we simply click on the button in the design ribbon. We can sort the connection by type and give the connection group a custom name. First, we'll create a group for the base plates of the columns away from the moment frame. Then we will create a group for the base plates of the column at the moment frames. Also, we will create a connection group for the shear tabs of the beams in the X direction, for the shear tabs of the beams in the Z direction away from the moment frames, and for the shear tabs of the beams in the Z direction at the moment frames. Keep in mind that a connection group can only be used for the connections of members that have the same structural shape. With all of the connection groups defined, we can scroll through the groups in the Find tool to make sure that we have everything correctly grouped. Selecting a base plate connection design group causes the Design and VA Connect button to become active in the ribbon, and clicking the button automatically launches VA Connect. In VA Connect's model view, we see that the member geometry has been imported, and switching to the load view, we see that the load information for each connection in the group has been imported. In VA Connect, we can adjust the parameters of the connection until all the limit states pass. Next, we can modify the report to document our work and include specific detailed reports or tables as desired. Upon exiting VA Connect, the design report we create is automatically sent back to Visual Analysis, which can be viewed as a PDF. Note that the connection design status changed from not performed to complete checks passed. Since this check passed, the connections in the group turned from gray to green in the design view. Now let's select a shear tab connection design group to design in VA Connect. If we do not make the appropriate modifications to the connection and it fails when we exit VA Connect, the design status in Visual Analysis says Complete Checks Failed. Also, the connections in the design view change from gray to red, indicating that they failed. In a similar manner, we can perform the connection design for all of the connection groups in our project. It is important to note that the import from Visual Analysis feature is unidirectional as visual analysis does not store any input data or changes made to the connection project files in VA Connect. Editing the model in visual analysis will reset the design status of the connections to not performed and they will need to be redesigned. Similar to visual analysis, VA Connect can be launched from within Visual Foundation and Concrete Bending. Both programs, however, are limited to steel base plate design. Simply select the desired piers in Visual Foundation or load points in Concrete Bending and click the Export to VA Connect button in the ribbon. This will launch VA Connect and import the geometry of the member and the loads from all selected piers or load points. The once tedious process of keeping track of loads at numerous locations from numerous load combinations for connection design 
has been made easy using the Export to VA Connect feature in Visual Analysis, Visual Foundation, and Concrete Bending. To try out VA Connect or other IES products for yourself, head over to our website and download the free trials.